I'm pretty convinced that the first line of reasoning is actually almost a self-fulfilling prophecy, that if we act with fear, and if we say, hey, we just got to stop doing this stuff, what's really going to happen is the rule followers might pause, might slow down, but the rule breakers, as Alexander mentioned, the totalitarian governments, the criminal organizations, they're only going to accelerate, and that leads to what I am pretty convinced is the dystopian state, which is the good actors have worse AIs than the bad actors. I don't think that means that, oh yeah, then we should just relax and just hope for the best. That might not happen either. I think all of us together have to fight like hell to make sure that we put the guardrails, we put in, when, it, when the problems arise, reasonable regulations, but we fight like hell for the positive use cases. Because very close to my heart, and obviously there's many potential positive use cases, but perhaps the most powerful use case, and a, perhaps the most poetic use case, is if AI, artificial intelligence, can be used to enhance HI, human intelligence, human potential, and human purpose.